and we are underway. The Knicks wearing their white uniforms. Only the second time in NBA history that the three leading scorers for the team all are lefties. We'll go deeper into the bag a little later on. Mitchell Robinson, his 36th dunk of the year. That was just a good find by Brunson. 13 assists. Brunson had last time these two teams. Uh oh, matched up. That's Nick cool. forgot all about number three. <laughs> Here's Barrett looking for help. Missed the layup, and there's that man again. Second dunk here in our first two minutes. Mitchell Robinson. Points down a pair. Terry. Oh, this time locked out of there by Mitchell Robinson. I told you he's a factor. Yeah, yeah. Again, the Hornets forcing tough attempts for New York. Plumley, Mason Plumley, not to be denied. Yeah, that left because of the tough shot by Randall. Celebrate with Steph and Aisha. Uh, it's a big time, big night. Had, had a lot of fun. R.J. Barrett, middle opens up for him. He scores and is fouled. Knicks have made their first substitution. Second-year point guard Miles McBride. He's basically replaced Derrick Rose in the rotation. Nick coming off a rare off game. He's been as consistent as a metronome this year. But just two points and no rebounds on Wednesday in Brooklyn. Yeah, didn't, didn't get any action that second half. That's the best thing that R.J. Barrett does, get to the cup. Only starter remaining in the game for the Knicks is the man with the ball. He, oh, my goodness, Kai Jones took it from R.J. Barrett. Look at Kai Jones! Something to dream of from the kid! German, what's that German pronunciation? Only starter in the game for the Knicks is R.J. Barrett, and he sets up Jericho Sims! Everybody got caught watching Kelly. Trying to show what he can do. Quickly the misfire. McDaniels the run out. Five on two. And you got to get yourself a layup. Yeah. Score the goal and a foul. Kelly Oubre. Uh, three minutes into this quarter. They're back in. Everything but down for Randall. Hartenstein keeps it with the Knicks. Physical in the paint. Quickly. That's a bonus three for New York. Terry the fadeaway. Got it. Rings the bell. Chance. Terry's taking all games so far and he made it. Turn around Brunson. That's his game. Mason Bumley back into the game for the Hornets. Oh. Julius Randall a fadeaway. Yeah, i tell you how tough that is. DJ. Small one. Scores on top of Brunson. Yeah. Every time Brunson goes around a screen, he is so tight. Randall. Oh, my goodness. Scoring the goal with the foul. On the offensive end this first half. Emmanuel quickly replaces Quentin Grimes. Randall. Bryce McGowan's the youngster put it on the ground more than he normally does. The game's there. First quarter, minutes, first off the bench. Blocked away. Kai Jones just checked into the game. Hornets want to run. McGowan! First off the bench. Blocked away. Kai Jones just checked into the game. Hornets want to run. McGowan! He's got the last five for the Hornets. Pick up the pace. Only four points in the first half for Terry. You know, I, I'm going to toot my horn. I said the keys tonight was ball security and rebound. Great start to the third quarter. Knicks begin the second half the same way they began the game. Brunson, Randall, Robinson, Barrett, and Quentin Grimes. Lee changed hands ten times in the first half. Brunson from the elbow. Loose ball dug out by Rozier. 
So McDaniels to free throws and then give him a layup. Yeah, nice run along the right side there. R.J. Barrett, an in-and-out dribble, score the goal and a foul. He has been super effective attacking the rim. Look at that move. Just wouldn't fall for McDaniels. Grimes. Catch and shoot three, Quentin Grimes. After the timeout, Hornets looking for some offense. Knicks have gone on a 14-4 run. Carey somehow got that over Mitchell Robinson. Losing that one. Carey averages 21.7. Look at R.J. Bear. This is a brand new R.J. Bear. Kelly Oubre. Gets his own miss. And give him continuation. Yes. Chance for a three-point play. Challenges Randall and wins the battle. Mason Pumley set up beautifully by PJ. Yeah, PJ, nice curl off that little screen between the two big men. Look at that. Deuce McBride with the steal. And it leads to the deuce on the other end for Quentin Grimes. To call him Deuce and nothing good happens for the Hornet. Back to being Miles. Uh, he was Brandon Ingram, Lonzo Ball. Right. All right. All right. Uh oh. That's how we start our fourth quarter with a punch from Isaiah Hartenstein. And Kai Jones, who was impressive in the first half. Kelly leans in and flips it up and in. Bobby flipped that one in. Hartenstein, a rare jumper. Oh, my goodness. When it rains, it pours. Wow. He'd only made four out of 19 from behind the arc this year. I'm trying to stump you. <laughs> it look easy. He gave me the G League. Team. Oh, my goodness. Oh, wow. Isaiah Hartenstein had seven quickies. Great job of pestering by McBride, and it results in a steal. Another turnover. And the Hornets lost track of R.J. Barrett. Steve Clifford says, guys, we got to get on the same page. Coming unravel here. Ty Jones thought about it. Instead, goes into attack mode. Had it blocked by Hartenstein. Tao saves the day. Wow. Good tough shot right there. Quickly. I'm telling you, it's almost like a badge of honor, man. It means you attack. That's right. Look at Kelly Oubre. Clean air for Kelly. And now Tom Thibodeau calls a timeout. Jalen Brunson comes back in the game. Brunson trying to get his. Only got nine points. Oh, my goodness. Jericho Sims with bad intention. Right point is three. Terry, beautiful circus shot. Give him the reverse. So he's inching closer and closer to 20 points. Now it's 16. She played Division One basketball at UT Arlington. Terry, another circus shot. <laughs> oh my goodness! Easiest two of the night for Mason Plumley. And again, Tom Thibodeau wants to talk things over. With that loss, the Hornets now fall to seven and 19 overall.